Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about Hamming codes. In previous tutorial, we studied about Hamming distance and minimum Hamming distance. Right. Now, what are the Hamming codes? Hamming codes are error correcting codes. And here we will discuss the Hamming code with minimum Hamming distance 3. Right. As you can see here, Demon. Demon represents minimum Hamming distance. So, what happens? Uh, here uh, we will discuss the Hamming code with minimum Hamming distance 3 so they can detect up to two errors and correct single error right now suppose data word has k bits code word has n bits and m is the number of check bits right then what happens the values of n and k are calculated from m by using these two equations right n is equal to 2 raised to power m minus 1 and k is equal to n minus m right now suppose m is equal to 3 right here in this example of Hamming code we will uh, we will discuss uh, which we are going to discuss in this example uh, we will consider that the number of check bits are 3 right m is equal to 3 so how many bits will be there in code word so n is equal to 2 raised to power m minus 1 so n is equal to 7 so code word will have 7 bits and uh, how many bits will be there in data word uh, k is equal to n minus m right so here n is equal to 7 m is equal to 3 so value of k will be 4 so data word will be of 4 bits right now suppose the data word is a3 a2 a1 and a0 right uh, as i have told you that in this example data word will be of four bits suppose a3 a2 a1 and a0 they represents the bits of data word right and suppose the check bits are r2 r1 and r0 right so therefore the code word will be this a3 a2 a1 a0 r2 r1 r0 right now <coughs> See what happened, these check bits R0, R1 and R2, they will be evaluated by these equations, right? The values of uh, these check bits R0, R1 and R2, that will be evaluated by these equations, right? So here you can see that R0, R0 is the parity bit of A2, A1 and A0, right? So that uh, together R0, A2, A1 and A0 they must contain even number of ones right similarly r1 is the parity bit for a3 a2 and a1 right and uh, r2 is the parity bit of bits a1 a0 and a3 right now it will be clear after this example now let us consider this example suppose there is a data word there is a data word 0 0 1 1 right so here uh, you can see that uh, bit a3 is equal to 0 a2 is equal to 0 a1 is equal to 1 and a0 is also equal to 1 right now uh, we will find the value of check bits r0 r1 and r2 so r0 is the parity bit of a2 a1 and a0 right so a2 a1 a0 it is 0 1 1 right so you can see that 0 1 1 it has even number of ones therefore r0 will be 0 right as uh, you can see similarly r1 r1 is the parity bit of a3 a2 and a1 right a3 a2 a1 it is 0 0 1 right so here you can see it has odd number of ones right it has odd number of ones a3 a2 a1 so to make it even number of ones right so to make even number of ones r1 should be equal to 1 right so a, a check bit r1 will be equal to 1 now r2 right uh, here you can see that r2 is the parity bit of a1 a0 a3 a1 a0 a3 is 1 1 0 right now you can see that 1 1 0 it has even number of ones therefore r2 will be equal to 0 right now what happens the code word so what is the code word code word is a3 a2 a1 a0 r2 r1 r0 right so here data word is 0 0 1 1 right and uh, the value of check bits 
R2, R1 and R0, 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 right? So the code word will be 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, right? Now, uh, this is the way how the code words are created in this uh, Hamming code, which uh, we are going to study. Now, what happens uh, when this uh, code word is sent at the receiver, right? How the errors are detected and corrected in this uh, Hamming code. Now, we will study that. Now, see how this uh, Hamming code is used for error correction and detection purposes. Now what happens at the sender, at the sender for a data word, a code word is created and then code word is sent to the receiver. Now at the receiver what happens, at the receiver it is checked whether the code word is having uh, any error, right? When it is found that there is an error, right, then uh, what happens that error is corrected. So here I have told you that uh, what happens so here we are discussing the Hamming code which is having the minimum Hamming distance 3. Right. So in this case, we can detect only up to two errors and we can correct only single error. Now, how the error is corrected in this Hamming code that we are going to study now. Now, suppose the code word A3, A2, A1, A0, R2, R1, R0. This code word is received at the receiver. Right. Now, what happens at the receiver? It is checked whether it is correct or not. So what happens? At receiver, three bits as two, as one, as zero, they are evaluated by using these equations, right? Now, what happens as zero is zero if a two, a one, a zero, and r zero has even number of ones. Otherwise, as zero will be one, and this bit as one. As one is zero if a three, a two, a one, and r one, they have even number of ones. Otherwise, it is one. Right. Similarly, S2 is 0 if A1, A0, A3, R2, they have even number of ones. Otherwise, this bit S2 is 1. Right. So, when this code word is reached at receiver, right, then what happens? These three bits, S0, S1 and S2, they are evaluated by using these equations. Right. Now, what happens at receiver? After evaluating the values of S2, S1 and S0, right, then we can find out uh, which bit contains error, right. So when it is found that which uh, bit has been changed during uh, transmission, then at receiver that incorrect bit is changed to make it correct, right. Now what happens if S2, S1, S0, these three bits are 0, 0 and 0, then it means that there is no error there is no error in code word if these bits are 0 0 1 it means the error is in bit r0 right if these bits are 0 1 0 right then the error is, is is in bit r1 if it is 0 1 1 if these three bits s2 s1 s0 these are 0 1 1 then the error is in bit a2 if these three bits are 1 0 0 then uh, the error is in bit r2 if they are 1 0 1 then the error is in bit a0 if it is 1 1 0 then the error is in bit a3 if the all bits are 1 right s2 s1 s0 they are 1 1 1 then the error is in bit a1 Right. Now it will be more clear after this example. Now suppose, uh, suppose uh, the sender has sent this code word 00110010. Right. But what happens when this code reached uh, at a receiver? Right. This bit, this leftmost bit has been changed during transmission. So the receiver has received this code word 10110010. Right. So here in this code word A3 bit is 1, A2 bit is 0, A1 bit is 1, A0 bit is 1, R2 bit is 0, R1 bit is 1, R0 bit is 0. Right. Now what happens when this code word is reached at receiver, what we will do? We will evaluate the values of S2, S1 and S0. Right. Now uh, for S0 the equation is this A2 plus A1 plus A0 plus R0 modulo 2 so a2 is 0 a1 is 1 a0 is 1 right now you can see here 
the uh, this 0 1 1 0 right it has even number of ones so value of s0 will be 0 right similarly uh, this is the equation of s1 a3 plus a2 plus a1 plus r1 modulo 2 a3 is 1 a2 is 0 a1 is 1 r1 is 1 so a3 a2 a1 r1 you can see it has odd number of ones so value of s1 will be 1 right so here you can see the value of s2 we can find out the value of s2 by this equation a1 plus a0 plus a3 plus r2 modulo 2 right a1 a0 a3 r2 it is 1 1 1 0 so it has odd number of ones so value of s2 will be 1 right so in this way we will evaluate the value of bit s2 so s2 s1 s0 right it is equal to 1 1 0 right so when the value of s2 s1 s0 is 1 1 0 right then it means the error is in bit a3 right it means the error is in this bit a3 right so to correct the error we will change the value of bit a3 right here in this code word the value of bit a3 is 1 right so we will change it to 0 so this is the correct code word right so in this way this having code can be used for error correction purposes right now there are two main points uh, in this having code which we have studied in this if two errors occur during transmission then the created data word at the receiver might not be the right one right it can uh, correct uh, only single error the having code we have discussed here it can correct only single error and if we want to use this uh, code for error detection then we need a different design right so this uh, having code which we have discussed here it can correct only single error right now here in this example uh, what we have done we have found that the error was in bit a3 so we have changed the bit a3 to get the correct code word and from this uh, code word after removing these check bits we can get the data word right so after correcting this code word what this uh, uh, receiver does it removes the check bits and it gets the code word right